I'm Scott Indigo. And I'm Keith Lemon. And we're here to bring you the Eagle Eye News. First, I'd like to say that the ninth of the twelfth month, which has been called many names, but we know her as December, will be a field trip for 7th through 12th grade. We are going to Nelson Atkins Art Museum, and it should be fantastic. After a day at the Art Museum and some lunch at Crown Center, we will be proceeding to go ice skating at the Crown Center Ice Rink or shopping for those who are not skating. And also, the following day on the 10th, the Holiday Gift Shop will open. Buy a gift for yourself or someone else, and have yourself a merry little Christmas. Feel free to roast chestnuts on an open fire, and watch out and don't pout, cause Santa Claus is coming to town. Gift wrapping is provided. Fantastic! Which also brings us to the 17th of December. Very important day. In fact, it is also known as the 17th of December. Very good. Now, grades 7 through 12 will not be attending school, sadly, because of Christmas break. So try not to cry. Wipe away those tears. Because you'll be back around the 4th of January to see all those teachers you love so much. But however, K through 6th grade, you get an extra half day of school! Woohoo! Now over to sports with Scotty. Thank you, Scott. Glad to be here on this wonderful Friday morning. I'm glad to be here. And you know what? Next week we're going to be having some games coming up. We got on Monday. We have a boys and girls varsity are going away to Plaza Heights at 3.30 is when that bus is going. And they're going to be heading over to giving it all they got. On Thursday, the JV boys and the varsity boys are heading over to Osanam at leaving at 4.30 on that bus and giving everything they can against that Ozanam team. And as a word of encouragement, I give you this quote from Franklin D. Roosevelt. When you come to the end of your rope, tie a knot in it and hang on tight. So hang on tight to whatever you got, because you know what? You're not at the end of your rope. I know you can climb back up that thing and you can fight with all you got and you can get your victory whenever you feel like it. Jeez, yes, I believe in you. I believe in everything you got. Merry Christmas to everyone, and may you have a wonderful weekend. Back to you, Scott. <clears throat> yes, thank you, Scott. <clears throat> oh, it's me. Ah, yes. Well, oh, you students may not have known this, but you may also have known this. Yesterday was Hanukkah. For those who had no idea, it had existed. And as proof, I have David Oshel here. Merry Krishna. Thank you, David. Of course, it isn't proof, really, but he is a priest, which proves my point. Precisely. Now, for those of you who care, there will be a new moon on Tuesday. And no, I am not talking about Twilight. No, we are Jeez. And that brings us to the fact that Tuesday is National Pearl Harbor Remembrance Day. So remember those who died in Pearl Harbor. That's very good. Very good to remember. Now, Around this time of year, a Christmas play gets thrown in with the jingle jangle and hoo-ha. Yes. Don't forget the hoobulation. Ha-hoo. And it will be awesome. The third and sixth are participating in this great event as well as the dramatic class. So grab a few friends, family, some random people you've never seen before in your life, and all the money you've got. Donations are given to Jordan Metcher. Don't believe yes, anything indeed. else they say. It will be at 7 p.m. on the 14th of December. And now we'd like to head over to weather with rain or shine. Thanks, Scott! Aloha! I know, it's cold outside and, well, I look a little weird. But, it's because I want you to think warm thoughts. Warm thoughts, Hawaii. Florida, warm. Now let me show you just how 
cold it's going to be because I want your day to be awful knowing that it's going to be cold. This is my Santa cup. Are you ready for this? Today, on this lovely Friday, it's going to go from 40. And from that 48, the low is going to be 33. Now let me show you again how cold it's going to be getting. Because not only is it going to be cold today, but tomorrow it's going to drop down from 40. On Sunday. It's unbearable. I know. I know. But let's deal with this. We have one more cold weather to go through. It's gonna be 39 with a sad, sad low of 20. cold, but, but, we will think warm thoughts, and we will be warm and happy. So, with that in mind, have a great weekend. Back to you, Scott. Thank you, Rain. Yes, very good with the weather you got there. Now, I must remind you students out there that the permission slip for the field trip to Crown Center will be t must turned in by Monday with your money. So, you should do that. Yes, indeed. Now, this is us signing off. I'm Scott Indigo. I'm Keith Lemon. And that's the way. The mustache curl. Waxes. <laughs>